Hello and welcome. It's good to have you. Have you ever wondered why plastic is so bad for the environment? That's right. It's because of its non-degradable nature. Once plastic pollutes the environment, it doesn't really go away. But there is a solution. Avocados. That's right. Stay tuned if you want to find out more how avocados may be a solution to the plastic problem. Avocados have gained popularity all over the world. Due to its versatile nature and incredible taste, the ancient Mexican fruit has been embraced globally, making it earn the title of the world's trendiest food. But despite this, the inedible parts from the food have caused serious negative environmental impacts, reason being that they do not decompose easily. So, most of the wastes end up in landfills, causing tremendous damage to the environment. Lucky for us, a solution was found to make this narrative a thing of the past, Bioface, a Mexican-based company specialized in making biodegradable, sustainable and affordable cutlery forks, spoons, knives and even straws from leftover avocado pits. The company was founded in 2014 by a chemical engineer, Scott Munguia, who after years of research finally discovered that avocado seeds contain a biopolymer similar to the one in corn used to create bioplastic. The products are sustainable for both hot and cold foods and take only 240 days to decompose after being buried in the ground or exposed to the elements. Honestly, that's quite a long time in a world where environmental consciousness is at its peak, but it's still better than petroleum-based plastic bottles, which can take more than 450 years to decompose, whilst plastic bags can take 10 to 1000 years to break down. The company's efforts are just one in many that are continuously doing research on bioplastics as a replacement for plastics. Bioplastics, also known as a plastic of the future, are plastic materials produced from renewable biomass sources, such as vegetable fats and oils, cornstarch, avocados, wood chips, potatoes, cassavas and many other foods instead of petroleum. The plastics are fully and identical and indistinguishable from petroleum-based plastics. Currently, bioplastics only make up 3% of all plastics, but the market is continuously growing. As companies such as Bioface are entering the market to cater for the high demand, Bioface converts approximately 15 tons of avocado seeds a day into cutlery, and they ship the products across Mexico, Europe and Australia where they are primarily used in restaurants. The company uses the normal recycling process. It's a patented process that uses technology to transform the avocado pits into a bioplastic resin, the first non-degradable food-based one of its kind that can withstand heat. The final product comes in the form of a sheet that can be molded and cut. Although bioplastics from avocado decompose much faster than their counterparts, they still contain some level of traditional plastics. The plastic can only decompose as fast when collected and sent into an industrial composting facility for composting. If one decides not to dispose them in their designated collection area and just throw it into the environment, it will have the same environmental impact as petroleum-based plastic. Bioplastics aren't the perfect replacement for traditional plastics, but the development of such products by companies such as Bioface might be the start of the plastic revolution. Thank you for listening. If you like the content, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up.